Good morning from Tanzania, from the western outcrops of the Usambara mountains. We see over a depression on the opposite side the South Pare mountains. Uh, when I did the research in chameleons, for 30 years I have seen them doing everything, mating, uh, feeding, uh, imposing each other and so on, but I have never seen them drink. And I thought, what is it? Is it a bias of my observation or is it really like that? It sounds crazy that chameleons do not drink in the wild. I have even observed chameleons that they do not drink when it rains, even after several months of drought, instead of running after each uh, drop of water, they hide it in a bush, bush and started to sleep. So it was ridiculous and I, I was like really interested and intrigued by that, that idea that chameleons might not drink. But then the question is how they gain the water and the answer is here in this landscape. If you see the countryside now at 7 a.m. is covered with fog. It is sometimes dense, it is less dense, but you can see there is fog everywhere. So the chameleons necessarily sit in the fog almost all the night. When it comes, they sit in the fog. Parts of the fog are of course the clouds that you can see on the slopes of the Pare Mountains now and during the daytime as it becomes more hot the clouds will raise step by step to reach the level over the peaks at noon. So what does it mean? Chameleons have a specific ability to hydrate through an effect that I call fog drinking. They sit in the fog, inhale a uh, moist air that is has 100 uh, percent uh, humidity and they have an ability to absorb the water they need for their everyday lives during the night while breathing the fog. 